Palillo, officially the municipality of Palillo, Tagalog, Bayan ng Palillo, is a third-class municipality in the province of Quezon, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 30,582 people. It is located on the southern part of the eponymous Palillo Island fronting the Philippine Sea and its jurisdiction also includes Balasan Island in Laman Bay, 14 degrees 25 minutes 30 seconds north, 122 degrees 02 15 e. Geography Palillo is located about 29 kilometers 18 miles off the eastern coast of Luzon. It is bounded by municipality of Panaculan in the northwest and the municipality of Berdios in the northeastern side of the island. Laman Bay bounds it at the south, east and west. It is 24 kilometers 15 miles east of the municipality of Infanta and 27 kilometers 17 miles east of the municipality of Real. It can be reached by motorboats more or less three hours via Real Palillo in the Ungos port and a little bit shorter via Infanta Palillo through Dinahican Fish Port. Barangays Palillo is politically subdivided into 20 barangays. History Trade relations between the natives of the Palillo Islands and Chinese merchants existed long before the Spanish conquerors came to the archipelago. Trade was a conglomeration of Malay Hindu Chinese Tagalog. Padre Morga wrote that Palillo originated from the Chinese word, Pulilu, which means beautiful island with plenty of food. When Juan de Salcedo, a Spanish conqueror came to Palillo in 1567, he saw a central government fully organized through the Balangay, with a Datu who had a direct supervision and control over all the natives. The inhabitants lived in Nipa huts. In 1571 the Spaniards took hold of the islands of Puli Lu. Through the leadership of Padre Domingo, a Spanish friar, a chapel was built, where the old Spanish church was later constructed. After one and a half years, the people through forced labor built a concrete wall to protect the Pueblo of Pulilu from Moro pirate invaders. Watchtowers called Castillos were erected in the four corners of the Pueblo. The church was constructed in 1577. Boulders, gravel and sand were mixed with lime produced out of seashells and coral stones. Padre Domingo instigated the planting of sugar cane in San Isidro, San Antonio and San Francisco. Production of molasses was put into full swing. Spanish conquistadores were assigned to the Pueblo of Pulilu to promote church construction. The church tower was constructed with priority, so that in 1587, in the early summer of May, two huge bronze bells rang atop. Due to language problems, Padre Domingo changed Puli Lu to Palillo. In 1942, the occupied by the Japanese Imperial forces landed in Palillo. In 1945, the liberation by the Philippine Commonwealth troops of the 5th and 52nd Infantry Division of the Philippine Commonwealth Army landed in Palillo we fought the battles against the Japanese forces in the Battle of Palillo Island during World War II. In recent years, government-funded infrastructures were built and private investments in hotel, resorts, services and utilities increased. A notable personality, Rafael Rafi Puchero Nant, a former three-termer first district congressman of Quezon 1998-2001, 2001-2004, 2004-2007, 2000s, and governor of Quezon Province 2007-2010. Governor Rafi P. Nant, fondly called as Kuya Rafi, died in a helicopter accident that crashed into two houses at Hale Subdivision 1, Barangay Iam, Lucena City on Monday, May 17, 2010, about 3.15 p.m. He had just attended a regular weekly flag-raising ceremony at Quezon Convention Center in Capitalio, Lucena City, Quezon, Philippines. Demographics Fiesta Celebration The town of Palillo is celebrating its founding anniversary every March 18 more than 400 years ago. The celebration lasts for at least three days. Starting from March 17, there are different celebrations held in the town proper including the 
Gabi ng Parangal. Coronation Night of the Town's Beauty, Binabining Palillo and all the ladies representing different barangays. March 18 is the most awaited day of the celebration where a big parade can be seen by all the natives and guests. The Parada includes all the schools, NGOs, LGUs, all the barangay participants and more. The most awaited groups in the parade are the Banda school bands, from different schools and school levels. Celebration will continue until nightfall with the Sayawan at the town plaza. March 19 is the Feast of St. Joseph, the patron saint of the town. The celebration starts from a procession together with all the patron saints of all the sitios and barangays and all devotees of St. Joseph, including all the sitio's and barangay's patron saints in the procession is known as De Pit. Many believes that this celebration of the Feast of St. Joseph plays big part from the town's safety against nature disaster especially typhoons. It has something to do with the church history where those saints served as protector along the region. Devotees of St. Joseph now turns the old St. Joseph Parish into Prelature Shrine of St. Joseph as ordered by the Bishop of Infanta, B.P. Rolando J. Tria Torona, O.C.D. D.D., year 2010 under the leadership of F.R. Noe Ramos, former parish priest of the town. Travel Getting to Palillo from Manila takes around six hours of travel by land and by sea. The first segment of the trip involves traveling to Ungos Port in Real, Quezon via the Palia Fami Real Road. The recently opened Marikina Infanta Highway is also another route to Ungos Port. Raymond Bus with its terminal located in Lagarda, Manila, has regular scheduled trips to Real, Quezon. There are two regular boat trips from Real to Palillo. The first trip usually leaves at 7.30 a.m. as the bus passengers coming from Lucina and Manila try to catch it up. The next boat leaves at 10 a.m. The boats are outrigger types powered with a surplus truck engine. The return trips from Palillo are at 5 a.m. and 1 p.m. The trip from Ungos Port to Palillo usually takes three hours. There are passenger ferries that depart from Dinahican Port in Infanta to Barangay Magnit in Palillo. There are also boat trips to Balasan Island and Palillo from Atimanans Port. References External links Philippine Standard Geographic Code Philippine Census Information Local Governance Performance Management System Quezon Province Community and Web Portal